Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video we're going to be playing Gold Rush the game. We're going to be showing you how to do a tier 3 setup. So the first thing, we're going to follow it exactly as the tutorial says. So go to the bank or the tablet and upgrade the parcel. So right now we only have one machine. Upgrade that for 20k. Confirm. And we'll exit. Now it's telling us to go to the machine store. Okay, so we need to buy the shaker. So 85,000 here. Add one. Uh, we're going to do this exactly how the tutorial wants, so we'll buy one duplex jig. If you want to max out your tier 3, you're going to buy two of these. It wants us to buy the Strommel. So there's 26,000. Well, basically 27, I forgot to check this one. 38. Then you're going to need some sluice boxes. So the S rocks for a thousand. You're going to need one of those. Then we're going to need an ST sluice box. You're going to need one of those. And then if you're going to have two duplex jigs or anything higher, you're going to need two of these. So two of the T. DJ sluice boxes for 500. Oops, we'll add, we'll add one. And then we're going to need the big power generator. We'll add one of those. And a front end loader. And this is going to cost us 130. Add one. So now we can finalize our purchase and check out. So you go to the checkout window. Order total comes to 325,000. All right. We'll go to the transport window. And we'll click on the front end loader. The shaker, duplex jig, trommel, S-Rock sluice box, ST sluice box, uh, TDJ sluice box, and the big power generator. And we'll those. That's going to run us $7,575. Now we got to drive back to our claim. Once you get back to your claim, they're going to ask you to go uh, unlock the equipment store on the tablet. So, $20,000. Okay. And it's kind of annoying, but you'll have to back out to get each of your next uh, things. So we need a big transport crate. I think that's in the accessories. Yes, big transport crate. That's going to be 218. We'll check out. Again, back out. Four 5-meter steel tables. So we'll go back to the equipment store, accessories. And I already forgot. I think it was 5 meters, so we'll do that for those. Check out, that's going to run you another 83. Pack stuff into the transport crate. Alright, so we just got to pick these up and drop them in the crate. And it's going to say attach the T DJ sluice box with the cables. So we'll put that in the back of the truck. Alright, as you can see, you can just roll in here, just barely wide enough. So you get this into place. Um, we're just going to lower it down. There we go. Alright, now we're above it. We'll just shift, go down. Alright, so you're going to want it to look something like this. So you got the engine on the right side, you're coming in from the top. And just kind of switch to the other mode. Oh, why is it getting all twisted? That shouldn't be happening. Um, well, that's going to make it a little more challenging.
There we go. I think we got it. There we go. Got it a little more straight when we uh, did that. Raise this up. And you want to make sure you have the little um, end. I don't know if I can show you, but. There we go. Um, you want to make sure this little thing is on the, this, towards this side, the outward side. All right, now we got the shaker hooked up. You're gonna want the slanted, uh, big rail type things on the right hand side. And just so you guys know, I am using the small excavator so you can make all this work with the small one. And then lower it down, there we go. Gotta move the power generator. And really anywhere over here is good. Oops, that's not what I wanted. Now it's asking us to buy three buckets. So go to the equipment store. I think it's just in the main category here now. Accessories. There we go. Three buckets, check out, order. Then it wants us to put two under the duplex jig. That's an egg there. We'll take one here. two buckets. Put a bucket on the ST sluice box. There we go. Now it's telling us to buy two high voltage power cables in the online shop. So we'll go to the equipment store. I believe it's accessories again. Here we go, high voltage, we'll grab two. Check out, order, back out, oh, um, buy a low voltage cable extension cord, again accessories, so here's the low voltage cable extension cord, add one, check out, order, two low voltage power cables, back to accessories, power cables two, Connect them to the shaker. So we'll put the power cable here and right here. So now the shaker's got power. Now I need the trommel. So I'll put the power cable here and run that right to here. Oops. Now we got power to that. Now we need to hook up the duplex jigs, or I guess we only have one. But if you had multiple, so we'll uh, go from here. I think it's going to be. We're just we're actually going to just jump straight off. There we go. Very practical, I know. All right. So for some reason, my my online store, so basically the equipment store but online through the tablet, only has four trailers. So I had to come all the way here and I wasn't even sure if it would work. Um, but it's telling me to attach the trailer so it must be working. And we'll go on to the next step of the tutorial. Oops. Alright, we've put it in the parked area. Alright, and the game wants us to detach the trailer. So we did that. Now it's telling us to buy two huge water hoses from the online shop. Uh, 
Maybe it should be accessories, huge water hoses, two, check out, order, close. Now it needs a huge water splitter, equipment, accessories, here we go, huge water splitter, we need one of those, order, exit, one fat hose, equipment store, accessories again, and fat, fat water hose, add one, check out, order, and now we need to connect the hoses. All right, so we're gonna take a fat water hose, we're gonna put it in the inn, and then we're gonna run down to the river, and let's drop it. And now it's saying we need to connect the huge water splitter to the big water pump. So in order to do that, we'll need a big hose, hook it up in the out, we're gonna run it up this way, We'll just drop it right above here somewhere. Now we're going to grab the water splitter. Throw that down and then we'll put this connected up to there. Now we'll grab the fat hose. Connect that there. And then we'll connect that up to the shaker. So now that has electricity and water. We need to go back in here, grab six miner's moss. Uh, what is it? Do, 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 do. Here we go. And if you're going to have two um, sluice boxes or whatever, duplex jigs, sorry. If you're going to have two dupl duplex jigs, you're going to need 12 of this, uh, six on each side. We'll grab six. We'll get out of there. It's telling us to grab three miners' grills. So that's right here. And again, you'll need six of those because you'll have to double it if you want some for both sides. Take that out. All right, back to the equipment store. We'll buy uh, four sluice box crates. Check out. Order. Exit. Now put sluice box crates in place. Take off each of these. We got two of them placed. Grab the third. And we'll grab the fourth one. Oh. There we go. Alright, so you're going to need the mats first. And it's telling me that it's washing away the gold without the grills. But this is strictly for educational purposes, so we're not actually uh, mining anything. We'll grab one of these grills. Put on the second one, and we got two more mats to do. Oh, threw that one over. All right, so there's what this looks like. Turn on the big water pump. How about the start button? Jump in the front end loader and pour some dirt in. And yeah, that's a full scoop right there. So we'll raise it all the way up, get kind of close to the right hand side here, drop it in. Alright, so now it's telling us that that is the end of the tutorial.
And then if you want, you can actually put a hog pen with a pump in the sluice box and sluice box extension, four hog pan mats, and then you need a, a water hose going back up to the to the thing up here to the uh, water splitter here. So we're running this hose down to here. Then we'll take this water splitter, connect that. Then we'll take a smaller hose. Oopsies. Connect that, and then you'll put it right into the uh, hog pen with a pump there. It has to be the one with the pump. So the first thing you're going to need is the sluice box core and that will allow you to put the uh, hog pan pump with a pump on it and then you can put the extension as well and then all your mats in there. So now we'll take this cord or a hose rather put it up to there and then now when we run some dirt It'll come down through here. This will collect uh, gold on there. Then it'll run into the trommel. It'll go down. If you have two of them, it'll come out both these two sides here. Um, you'll catch some gold in this. You'll catch gold in these. And then you'll catch gold in here. So you'll have four mats, two buckets, six mats, and then four crates with gold. And that is the tutorial on how to do a tier three wash plant setup. Thank you guys for watching. If you wanna watch another video, there's a random video on screen and another playlist. Please be sure to share the video, like it, comment, and subscribe. Turn on those bell notifications so you're notified when I upload. And until next time, peace.